talk, doing the walk. The most talk. For the numbers. 2020 predictions. And now we're doing album of the year. Guys, what is it when you think of a, an album? <clears throat> what what is it that you are listening for, if I've asked that correctly? Um the message. Mm. The sound. Mm. Um the artist's capability as well mm. and in, in regards to whether you are just stagnant in terms of one type of genre or can you right. actually mix it up for us mm. um, those are the couple of things i i do regard that i listen look to for, yeah. yeah i look for content number one um yeah especially lyrically and just vocally what what are you able to to do mm in terms of those two things. I look for, I now forgot, so Sally, maybe you can continue, then I can yeah. just get yeah, my thoughts yeah, back. Yeah, I, um, I guess we are looking for a body of work that and, and different moves. I want to be able to listen to an album and say, yo, I'm feeling a bit sad, so I can mm. do this one, I'm feeling like this, I can. So I'm, I'm looking for something that can really take me through all my yeah. emotions, where I feel mm. inspired, I feel like dancing, I feel like this, I feel mm. sexy, I feel bad. So yeah. Really feeling, I forgot to say I'm feeling, really yes, feeling, beat, mm. beat, vocal, lyrical <laughs> capabilities. Yeah. So how well it was written, the music mm. now, uh, how well it was sung or, or rapped, and, and feeling. Very yeah. important. Oh, I love songs that make me just. I see that word. Oh, mm. goosebumps of just your tummy, or you just like you know. You yesterday I was listening out. to a song mm. and it was talking about love, and I, I went to the bedroom, my husband's nice bedroom, and I started dancing. Oh. Okay. You know, doing because the song <laughs> made yeah. me feel because the song made me feel like that. Like yeah. oh, make me feel about my special person. Yeah. And I was like, why must I stand here and sing? To the stove as I'm cooking, hear the man, hear that man, man. man. Yes. That's what I'm you get what I'm saying, and so yeah. that's what I did, and that's what okay. I want from music, okay. mm. so to make me nominees? feel nah. Alright, so the nominees, uh, we've got uh, Ethnics with uh, Made in Namibia, mm -hmm. we've got uh, KB Illist with uh, Faith and Favor, then we have uh, PDK with the Grateful, Rose Black with Forbidden Fruit, <laughs> and then uh, Sally Boss Madame with Lucky Girl. Okay, Rose Black again, we did cover this the last category. Rose Black's music is nowhere on the Rose internet. Black, she has yeah. one song on Don Lu Africa, yeah. except now for radio stations, and I don't know how many. Um, so, can we just give a message to Rose Black, please? I think you like she needs to hear this. Director, Girl, which we hear about you. On? People are saying your <laughs> yeah. music is good. Your voice is so sensual. Just but out. we need to know where to find your music. We yeah, need to be able to find it. Because you, you are popping up, but you ain't popping. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, Ooh. like that was an oh. Crrr. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, okay, so I, this one is really tough. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Because you also look at the growth of the artist. Mm. Especially when it's somebody that has been in the industry for the longest period of time. With Rose Black, we're going to judge her based on as a newcomer to our ears. So we can't mm. judge her. You like can't, how is yeah. she even in this category? I don't get it. You'll be able to look at her past. If the album is past, nowhere. Mm -hmm, past work Maybe we need to have a conversation with the judges then. And we, yeah, we just need to understand <laughs> how, based on what do they judge these people from because if the music is nowhere near, mm -hmm. and you're calling it album of the year, the Namibian Music mm -hmm. Awards and Namibian people yeah, don't know the album, it kind of doesn't make sense. Mm -hmm. And it's frustrating. Because it's like, true. Because what that's what you're saying, it, it's frustrating mm -hmm. that, and, and now actually it makes our job even difficult. As, as, as media people, because now we constantly get judged that we don't give artists a chance. Or mm. know the but music. But then we have platforms like the Namas that, okay, fine, the judges are high and, and things like that, but come on, album of the year, if we don't even know the album. Yeah. Come it's deep, like, man, it's deep. It's, 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 like for album of the year, then you could have might just given it to Diamond Flat. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. Hmm? Okay. I didn't know directors said she she done she done what, she done she done she done Please don't, don't mention names because yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, um, don't mention I'll names. Don't come for us. Okay, so okay. I want us um, to talk about because we have spoken about Sally's album. I think yeah. I've said that in the other category yeah. already. Mm -hmm. That Sally, 
I expect that from her, for her to drop a bomb album. Masali mm -hmm. will drop, like I say, if she doesn't, it's just a walking like, play. She That's can't not be at that standard. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what we expect from her. Sally the album was expected. Yes. Yeah, she can play the voice. And, and she's actually yeah. one of my favorite writers locally. Yes. Ooh, Sally, yes. and, and, and I have to say, Frida, I'm not from a Bayern High Scrape. If you listen to say, Frida's music, writing wise, oh. lyrics wise, they, they, they can, they can write a, 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 a hit song, mm -hmm. a, an African hit song. Sally and Frida. Oh. Sally and Frida. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. People may, maybe don't listen to it sometimes because they look at other things, they look at beat paper. For Sally, they just hear how her voice goes, they or maybe they don't hear the lyrics. Really. But if you really listen, Sally can write. I think and she understands the well. instrument. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. There are artists that get an instrument and then they want to make a whole lot of noise on it, or then they want to be too soft on it, or then they want to. Like the beat, said noise, like only <laughs> the beat should give you a feeling to write. Mm. So if you get a nice, like a. How speed or whatever it is. Her, her yeah, don't come give me stuff about your own what mentions and your own what kind what what. No, talk Hip about things artists. that are more related uh, in terms of that type of what genre. What it feels, uh, what yeah. the song makes you feel like, and I guess she goes with that. Yeah, yeah. Real and, and she goes, she goes with that. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like you, it, it, we want to. It, it's almost like being a radio presenter. There's no point in me going on air. And I'm like, welcome to TikTok, and I'm Sally Jason, and this is Paula <laughs> Pimbo. <laughs> this is Paula From You know what I'm saying? Because now yeah. when you meet me, and you're like, oh, my Sally G. Pradensua, uh, we have to be authentic. We want to be able to, we, we need our artists to live what they are singing, mm -hmm. you know? And not so, just because, oh, you think it sounds just cool. Just because it sounds cool, yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. All right, so, so that is Sally, and uh, PDK, you guys also already mentioned in previous okay. episodes as well. Yes, um, the, um, um, they even mentioned in an interview, because I interviewed them last year, they said that this album, like two other albums, they really had a lot of songs that popped up at okay. once, mm. that really did well publicly at once. It's a Hambelela song, mm. I Wanna Love You, yeah. Sanka. Mm. Yes. There are certain songs that really just did good out there, okay. public-wise. But again, very few songs were what we haven't heard from them. Like you mentioned the other time, Wanna Love You is a standout because I can play that song on any radio station worldwide. Right. Okay, the ones that play urban music now. Right. Ma, songs it's a very a very local sound that you can't really sell outside, outside. the border. And by, by, by where PDK is now, the last album, I think they also experimented a bit with, with sounds that we can really take outside. But this album, a lot of it was a homey sound, a local sound, but also I Wanna Love It was, did really well. So, so we didn't really international. Get out of the box. Yes. So you, and you are saying that they are really comfortable within the Namibian market. Based yes, on they why do they are very producing well. for the Namibian market. Yes, only. and, and, and okay. I get it, that's the authentic <clears throat> sound and authenticity always works. For Made of Berg, Mar. At the level they're at right now, they PDK, PDK Mudon Sal. They should be outside like, represent. I don't know why I, like when I think of a country for PDK, I always think Angola for some reason. Hey, hey. Because they, 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 they have that hype, you know, then, yeah. and, and that sound is also. So, um, like I wanted to say about like Lioness, right? She went to go produce one of her songs like in another country. So I think that's also maybe a good step as well that maybe you should try to invest and, and investing it, it, it's easy to say you need to invest mm. but it's it, it's easier said than done because yeah. we're not our industry the market is not that huge. well yes. financed if i could put it like that so i think maybe to encourage pdk them i i hope that they can maybe go to another country like go to nigeria or go oh, to they would do mm. great in nigeria, go to nigeria and that nigeria. Sounds, just live just just, mm. just be there for like a week you know or whatever a month and just, you know, you've already Work left the label, at least you're not being held back or anything. Yeah. Mm. And you, well, you, okay. they've, you've proven to us already. Yeah. Since yeah, the first album that you dropped, yeah. you pro have proven to us that you guys are legendary right. yeah. in, in what you do, your music, the whole thing, not just music, themselves your as whole package. As well. yeah. You guys have dropped videos, you guys, you go out with the outfits, you guys performance-wise, you mm. kill it, and then the albums are good. So you've done enough to prove to us what you yeah. can do. It's time for now you guys. To, yeah. to they, level up, they mm, are the type of sense. group. Yes. They are yeah. the type of group that understands what they need to deliver within the studio and on the album, right. and what they need to deliver on stage. You know, you get artists that go on stage and they're like, 
I just went blank. What am I doing now? Now, PDK gives you that full performance as right. well. So they do yeah. understand. Full package, man. Yeah. And full package. And then not handsome. Handsome young man. <laughs> and, and I see Patrick has one of those apps, though. Ah, but Patrick is making it. We must look, we must look with, with, with brotherly and sisterly eyes. I, I have a man friend. I don't need those type of conflict. The brother's married, please. <laughs> He's married. But Eon, Eon is almost eligible in, in Capitonio. We're just looking. But Ooh. all the guys are taken, right? Oh, it's, only, it's, it's, oh, only Pedri, it's, it's only Pedri that's more, you know, out there with this. But you know, these what females only case? care about the ring. If the ring is ain't not on, there. oh my word. What is the case? Kamtonyo, Kamtonyo, yeah. I like it. I don't want Bambu Ogi's money. But they all Bambu. But they all Bambu. Dion is maybe a bit lighter for her. My favorite is my favorite. He's just like, oh, you don't get me when I'm just like. Oh my goodness! There you go, down. Okay, anyway, guys, okay, KP Illes, Faith and Faber. Um, Not my favorite. No, but, really. Mm, okay. Do I like it? Um, I'll, I'll go back to what I said again. That KP is just one of those sex appeal artists. Mm -hmm. um, and, okay, I'm, I'm going to be honest and say this. Sometimes, you know when you're like, I'm, I'm already, I'm who I am. So I can just step in and... I'm good enough, you know? Like, I don't sense any growth. I, lyrically, I love KP with that. Mm. But I just feel like there's a bit of, there was, there was maybe too much confidence. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and like I said, even the last time as well, there are some artists that are just, fans love them because of who they are. Mm. And sometimes it can get to your head. Okay. Because if you know KP, <clears throat> now, he's. He's very so likable. Right. He's mm -hmm. likable, like you said. There's some people that people just want to like, and he's he's one of those. Lyrically, also KP is one of those where man, I can fl fire flames. Mm -hmm. The kid can rap. Right. If you really listen to his lyrics, yeah. Because a lot of people are lazy to listen, especially when it comes to hip hop. People will yeah, be lazy yeah. to listen to a song because the genre is not really their thing or hip hop is not really just their thing. And so right. if the beat is not catchy enough, they don't really listen to the lyrics. Right. But KB is one of those artists, if you really, even if you're not a hip hop fan and you listen to his lyrics, yeah. you're like, da, but this kid is it's good. He's special. I, I, I he's like Sunny Boy, Paige yeah. from Ethnic. Yeah. There are certain rappers who Cannibal Huta, like lyrically, they're just good. Script is also in, in yeah. like Jericho Huta. Yeah. You just are good. Jericho, I Mara, you. I don't know what it is about this album. Maybe it's because it sounds more Afro poppy. For me, I don't know. You know what's the thing about this album? I loved, like, it, it's just not the thing is started. That Enough. No, that was more conscious English. rap for me. That's like true. I could also do not understand and wanted to listen to his music then. Because yeah. it was too conscious and it was yeah. too in that KP Ellis type of okay. you know mode. Mm. And I think with this one, he tried to commercialize it a bit. That's why he came out with the okay okay. And that's why that song went that big as it could, because it related to the um Namibian market. You know, and I think um, on this Faith and Favor album, also he really tried his best to give us a different um, flow. But I feel like mm. there is it didn't sound as well. It didn't sound authentic, That's for lack word. of a better word. Yeah. Like, like it didn't sound himself. Yes. If it makes sense, and, and I can go back. And that is the thing. The artist wants to penetrate, uh, penetrate the market. A different market, and we get saying. it, ne? Yeah. Ma, Thai, you still it's like RuPaul said once on Drag Race, ne? Change is Come constant. Mm. Yes, change is constant. That's the one thing that's constant in this mm. world. Mm. With our craft, what we need to do is we need to adapt to the change mm -hmm. in the world, but still so apply on. who we are. Hold on to and who we are and apply who we and are. Has. You really he, think so? He has. He has part he of sings, it. He has part of himself. He has part of himself, and he wants to still accommodate and let the other people see the other have side. Have you heard? Have you heard Motema by KP Ellis? I by 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 by, by DJ K was featuring KP. Mm. Have you guys heard Motema? Come on. Okay. Like, not on the album, but it's KP's. It's 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 it's, 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 it's song on his uh, okay. his previous uh, 39 album, or was okay. it a mixtape? Uh, yeah. Mm. And and have you heard the one with Afro Berries? Uh, what is the one with Mupu? But Nish, Ah, get lifted. Uh, get lifted. Get lifted. Yes. Those yeah. two tracks alone. But that, what KP did then? Mm -hmm. It was he took a a a, a, a beat that was not. He's the Afro it wasn't in his yes. Yeah. Yes. A hip hop. Mara. 
he rapped and, and he sounded saying. himself the, the mm. his punchlines, his flow, yes. it just worked. And that's but what I'm yeah, saying. I don't yeah, get that. that. I also didn't. Okay, maybe you guys should just I listen. Didn't, I want to listen. The Motema the vibes. Week, yeah. I want those the Motema, one Motema, one Motema, Motema, the Afro song vibes. Okay. And, and okay. It, it just, I don't know, I didn't listen to the full album yet. Yeah. Ma, the few that I've heard didn't. <laughs> For me, I got different flows within the album. I got uh, the commercial side of him, mm. and I got the KP that you guys are talking about, and I also got the slight, you know, trying to sing situation, which many might not like it. But for me, I do find it a bit adorable because there are certain things that artists kind of miss. It doesn't really sound that good, but if you do really pay attention to it, it kind of fits within the particular song that mm. they are on. I think KP. Um he must, he must, you guys remember, what is that song? Heta Pate. Mm -hmm. mm. Some of Jericho. Jericho. And, mm. That's, like that's, 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 I think, I'm encouraging him to, to look within that. Okay. More. Don't. The Afro Berry song. The Afro Berry yeah, song. Yeah. Yeah. And there is a song actually there. Jealous. Jealous. Oh. On the album, Jealous oh. is the title. We song. heard the, I saw oh, the, the one with the video, yes. Uh, okay, but the it's the same sound. Really, uh, it's the same sound as the Ice Prince one. It just sounds. There's something missing, and I think it's that authenticate this sound that's missing. You need a singer. Okay. Sound. Okay. I don't okay. know. Okay. Like, go within your roots and, and, and don't. I just want him to stay away from Afropop. We have enough of that. Go okay. traditional. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. Last thing that I really want to add is that a lot of times there. People might just have to do their 10,000 hours. He might have already done it. Mm. But sometimes it takes longer for some people mm. to find, because you find yourself, you grow as a person, exactly. mm. your, 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 your sense and style in music grows, and eventually you go find who you really are, and you get that sense of completion, and the music that you put out even will show. And I think there's more, there's time. Okay. There's time for growth, and there's space grow, yeah. for growth for okay. him. This is not the best that we've heard from this guy yet. Yeah. Because he is that good. I think okay. he's still finding yeah. his sound. Anyway. All right. Okay, let's vote. Let's talk about ethnics. Where are oh. you running? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Mm. Ah, Yo, this year, I have to say, was one of the most impressive albums dropped within this year. Yeah. Can we not just even talk about the album? Let's just talk about the singers, guys. Like, one by one, the one by one. <laughs> Let, let's not even get. <laughs> with the album you know when people are competing about the album mm. and they like come through a single yeah. that just destroys everything mm. that is what i get with this made in namibia i'm very proud of it i'm yeah. really proud of them I'm and for a first album wrote. for a first album there i, I have would to say, never have thought yo, like not ev time. everybody yeah. has dropped their first album project you can look at all of these people you look at sally adora mm. you look at but everybody, okay, PDK's first album was Smash. Yeah. That mm. was also a very impressive first album. Mm -hmm. as, as did it Moyon Yeah. Yeah. As Mara, Sayara. Yes, okay. Sayara. Yeah. As you, if you can think that yeah. far yeah. back, that was a proper I'm not that album. Old. Yeah. But I have to say, Nair, if you look at first albums of everybody, not many people, even Gaza, mm. not many people can say, yo, oh, my first album was Fire. a smash. Mm. I destroyed it, and that's with ethnics. Even though I don't like all of the songs on there because there's the interludes, Irika Boy, mm. Kuta, Daisa Bikita. Mm. It's not really yeah. my type of style in mm. music or what I go for. Right. Ma, I would give. The album is so good ne, that you don't mind how those Kaboy, yeah. Daika yeah. Boy song Eki sound. Your weekend. Composure. Composure is mm. my favorite. Omutima. Oh, mm. oh, oh. I'm sorry. Oh. Loving my life. Uh, Pelende, yeah. yo, the album, like, no, you, it's an album that you can play in the background over and over on repeat. Right. These guys are just one hack of a dynamic wall. Like, I, I do, I do favor their vocals, the way they merge as well. And if mm. artists can understand each other and work together like that, mm. I definitely love, love, love that. Yeah. Uh, I like the fact that um, Paige somewhat sings on it. Mm. And then you have... Esho that just oozes girl like girl voice you guys mm. like as no diver like I said the feeling mm. you see How those kids there you just want to give it to a baby you want to crawl in like a, a little star. baby like a fetus ne? and of your mommy so squirt love play when you hear oh. the girls I mean all brother. their songs you can oh. sing along to Yo. you can definitely like it's, it's yeah to. man it's it's special I have to say it's so you mm. want to hug the album. Mm. If an album was a person. And the other thing is also with, with, with groups, with groups that do come, they some do last and some break up. There was a point in time where ethnics was really quiet, where 
I thought they were done with each mm -hmm. other. Do you get what I'm saying? Until they came back and I was like, wait, so you guys have been finding yourself. You guys have been working mm -hmm. on yourselves. And when they got this, and, 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 and those are kids that you can tell me, it's they've been waiting for this moment for mm -hmm. a while. That album was so your guys. Mm -hmm. Dini was blood, sweat and tears. Mm -hmm. So fat so. And a lot of people there because yeah. the talent is so undeniable, especially Esho, because as I say in that stem of mark, people can already tell you mm -hmm. this, this talent undeniable. But with Paige, Paige is another story because yes, rappers have to prove somewhere. themselves. Mm -hmm with lyrics, with flow. It's a lot of things involved Paige. for a hip hop artist to prove themselves, but Paige does it also so effort. A lot of people, they don't know what no he after comment how good that guy is. No, he's good. He's this good. album shows you that and Future will also show you that Paige's level of talent is exactly, exactly. Esho's level of talent. Yeah. And the fact you? that they can play on every song, especially with the ad libs and those you know, Vicky mm here -hmm. and ate her. Especially where guys very, very well. And, and, and the last thing is Paige is a singer rapper. Yes. For sure, he's a tight dollar sign type. You just love him. Do you get what I'm saying? Ah. Like yo, yeah, it's time for us to vote. I guess so uh, Ethnics, KPE Les, PDK, Rose Black, Sally Boss Madame, those are the people that are in the category of Album of the Year. You go first this and time. Yes. Sally J. Of course, Sally Boss Madame, Lucky Girl. I enjoyed the album so much because the moods, man, you know, mm -hmm. I love, like, I, I, I just love how, first of all, I like the way that it's laid out. And I love the different genres. So yeah, I'm definitely going with Lucky Girl. Not because it's me. <laughs> Oh, hey, it's got my egg. It's it's not not okay, um, this one I have to go with Ethnics because, again, I said for first album, mm -hmm. this album is 10 out of 10. It's brilliant yeah. for first album. Um, again, the Sally one was a, a close runner up for me. Mm -hmm. Mara, it's because I expect that from Sally. Okay. I don't know. It's I don't a Sally know song. why. Makes sense. Yes, like okay. uh, Sally is. I don't know, man. I don't know. As as skin, if she rapped, so if she rapped on this album, it would have been something different for me. Ah, if you get what okay, I'm saying. Okay, next to her, so because she doubled the belt, he must be really But I mean, if, if it was something that different, it mm. would have been like it's say. But I I already expect just brilliance from okay. the girl. Okay. But I have to go with ethnics because for her first album, that yeah. album can compete with legendary yeah. albums yeah. or the greats. Right. Yes. I like it. I, I yeah. Like uh, for me as well, I'm you know um, caught up between Sally as well as Ethnics, uh, for yeah. mere reasons because both are really talented artists, uh, be it individually or being that in the group as well. And I kind of believe that all of them did their hard work to you know mm -hmm. give us this body of work. It was not an easy thing to do it. It was they were really really taking their time to work on it. Um, but if I have to select the album of the year. An album of the year that you just put in and you go do your dishes, you don't yeah. have to skip, you just let it play. Yeah. I respect everybody on this, but ethnics. Yeah. Ooh. I Ooh, Denzel, you are so extra, my friend. Ooh. 